Wait, Microsoft Excel. Hello, and welcome to another lesson uh, from yourtechvision.com. And today we're going to go over math problems, how you do inequalities and do other graphs. So the first thing I need to do is go ahead and put Excel in focus. Now I have the students do te a template out of a number line. So the number line is there and you uh, insert this information use, using less than and greater than. I'll just show you quickly. So we can do a less than. And basically, there are nine dashes within there. So that's going to be one. Let's say they need to insert a bullet. That's all in. And then you and all your bullets. Once the students find the bullets, and they may need help with that, but we've got a black circle right there. If they happen to have a numpad and you can do uh, Alt 7 and Alt 9, that's a very quick way to do a hollow bullet and a solid bullet. But if they don't have that option, they're going to have to do it with insert okay. symbols. So my students go Man. that route Man. Man. and then they're going to go ahead and uh, as you can hear, let me just move through. Circle bullet, D2. circle bullet, D2. circle bullet. D2. And the students know that they have nine. So the, if they want to put the bullet in the middle of the number, they know they need to put four dashes on the left, and then they bullet, and then the four dashes on the right, and that will center it perfectly. To get the perfectly centered uh, number, you're going to go ahead and hit your applications key, and you're going to hit F for format cells, and control tab to alignment. And here, when you tab in, you just need to make sure your horizontal and your vertical are centered, and that will center everything. So I'm going to hit escape out of there. Once the students do their problems, they're going to go ahead, shift right arrow, and select and they're going to copy control C and let's say they just need to input this into a document and they paste it. Now they have options. They can go ahead and right arrow to the option that they want. Let's say the teacher wants that option uh, but they have many so hit your control key right arrow through all your options and you can see the different options and so then the students our blind students can be doing the hollow bullet and the solid bullet just like the other students so okay. let me go to some work Word. that the students had, have Alt done Alt already Alt Alt and as you can see through the page they've got the problems and then they needed to start graphing it and you can Alt see Alt that the Alt graphs Alt are just beautiful Alt and of course Alt Kaylee Alt wanted Alt credit Alt for this Alt which Alt she absolutely Alt she Alt should Alt have Alt and so you have the number line and you have your inequalities, uh, solid bullet, and so greater than, equal to, or just greater than, you've got those options to input just like everybody else.